Multiplying complex numbers. So what we're going to talk about now is multiplying complex numbers or numbers that include the letter i, square root of negative 1. So let's take a look at something we know how to do, multiplying 4x times 7x. Here we just multiply and combine like terms. So the 4 gets multiplied by the 7, giving us 28. And we have the x times the x, so that gives us x squared. Okay. Very similar concept when we're dealing with i. Okay, we have the 3 times 5. This will give us 15, the i times i giving us i squared. Now, part of the definition of i is that i is equal to the square root of negative 1, but the other part is i squared is equal to negative 1. So using a simple substitution, we know that i squared is equal to negative 1. We can plug this in right here, and this ends up giving us negative 15. So, Multiplying with i is pretty much the same exact thing as multiplying with anything else. Just you always have to remember whenever you see an i squared, we can always substitute in negative 1.